Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm here with the embellishments on the 11th collab. It is hosted by Deb Houck, um, Deb Houck's Crafty Cottage. Each month on the 11th, we share embellishments that we have made to help build our stash. Um, these embellishments that I make can be used for adding accents to other projects, for including in swaps and um, things such as that. <clears throat> so for this month, I made these little tiny bow embellishments. Um, I was sitting here at my craft table trying to decide what I wanted to do. I happened to look around behind me and I saw one of my favorite punches. This is the little tiny bow punch. I'm not sure what brand this is. I don't know, it might be Martha Stewart. <clears throat> I'm not 100% sure. But um, I love using this punch for so many things. I think it's the perfect size. And then I was just going to do the little bows with the, um, I put some gems in the middle of them. <clears throat> Excuse me, my throat is very dry this morning. I'm getting ready to go to work. But um, then I decided I didn't really want just the bow by itself. <clears throat> Excuse me. And so I decided I'd put them on these little, um, I took my uh, scalloped punch and the one inch circle punch and just made these little bases. And then I did attach the bow with some uh, little mini foam dots from Stampin' Up. And so I think they turned out so cute. I did five in this purple, like glitter paper, um, five in some gold, and then five in this like holographic looking uh, paper. And the papers are, uh, now this gold for the bow was just like, I had these scraps, um, this one scrap piece of gold. So I was able to punch out from the little edges where I had big enough pieces to um, punch from. I did not have any solid sheets of that to do the background circles. So I pulled out another stack of paper and found some sort of a glittery gold that was close enough to matching. And then these are from Die Cuts with a View. I had the purple, the pastel was out of this. It's like a glitzy pastel pack. And then the other is called Holographics. And there's different um, pieces of like the um, holographic paper in here. Um, just different patterns which is pretty cool. So anyways, and, and then I just use white for the one inch circle. So that is what I have made for this month. I love how they turned out. I think they are absolutely adorable. So um, all the information will be in the description below for you to check out anyone else, um, or all the other participants and their videos to see what cute little embellishments that they have made. So I'd like to thank Deb for hosting this collab and I'd like to thank you all for stopping by and I will see everyone in my next video. Take care.